As a business leader, I've always believed that human capital is our greatest asset. Talent isn't gender specific, and if we fail to address the lack of senior women and visible minorities in Canadian business, in effect, we're choosing to leave economic growth on the table. Having the opportunity to work at RBC and under Gord's leadership has allowed me roles where I could really t make a difference in, in uh, how I went about sponsoring and mentoring and developing people, particularly women. And so it's something that has just completely changed what my career might have been. I was presenting recommendations for our diversity strategy at the Executive Committee, and this included establishing a diversity leadership council. And Gord offered to chair the committee. I didn't even have to ask him. And to this day, 11 years later, he remains the chair and is just as, in fact, I would say even more passionate about the work today. What was critical for what Gord did was that he effectively sponsored me into the senior role that I have here. And it didn't stop with just the first role. It was identifying where I could add other value and putting me into not just the CFO, but taking on the CAO mandate and broadening what I could do across the enterprise.